Did you find more puddles? Mm -hmm. You gonna splash? Let's play more puddles. Okay. Are we splashing in the puddles, Porter? Porter wishes he could splash in puddles too. Good morning, you guys. We are splashing in rain puddles this morning. Um, it has been raining like every day here in Ohio. It's just so crazy. First it was super hot and like felt like 100 degrees. Now it's cool and rainy. That's trash. Put it down. Thank you. The weather is always changing here in Ohio. You never know what's going to happen, but we are taking advantage of the rain and we are playing in some rain puddles. The other day I realized that Grayson's raincoat was 18 months size and he's in 3T clothes now. So I had to go to the store and get him a new one and so I went to Target. They had the cutest little frog raincoat. It's a 4T so it's a little big and you can see that on him because it almost kind of looks like a dress but he'll grow into it and it's so adorable. We're going on a Grayson walk. Going on a Grayson walk. Cruising all around the block. Going on a Grayson walk. Going on a Grayson walk. So we are continuing to look for rain puddles while singing. Not much has really been going on here, so I haven't been vlogging a whole ton. It's just kind of the same day in and day out, just like that summer melancholy of just like not really much to do and just kind of hanging out. And if it's warm enough, you go swimming. And if it's cold and rainy, you go puddle jumping. So it's not very exciting, but we do have some very exciting things coming up. Like I said, Anthony and I are going to um, Nashville to celebrate five years. So we're very excited for that. And my parents just booked a trip to um, Jamaica. So we're all gonna go um, in December. So that's something to really look forward to as well. So we're really excited. But for now, we are looking for rain puddles. <gasps> oh, don't do it, Porter. Oh, don't do it. Oh. Bibs. This is the new game we play every mealtime. Porter Hudson! Porter does it because you know Grace thinks it's funny. Usually it's spoons. We don't throw our bibs. We don't throw our bibs. He will not keep on bibs that attach in the back, so I have to do these that just have a hole for his head, otherwise he will take them off. Can you get the bib for me, Gray Gray? Mm -hmm. Porter. Go, go, go. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> we don't throw our bibs. I feel like just watching. This is my life with two kids. Wanna At least I have Gray to pick it up. Do you want to sing a song? <laughs> If all the raindrops were land and drops and gum drops, oh what a rain that would be! Standing outside with my mouth. Oh, 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 so intrigued by it. We keep walking past and then he keeps turning around and coming back because he is so intrigued by all the ants. And Porter's just along for the ride. Hi! We were gonna go to the park, but he's just so into the ants. I don't know if we're gonna make it or not. <laughs> he keeps saying they're marching. <laughs> like the ants go marching song. Porter has started to hold the bottle when he eats, which is such a big help. Although if I walk away, he tends to stop eating, so that's why I'm kneeling over him to make sure he eats. But he's being a big boy. He is 10 months old tomorrow. Huh. And you're holding your bottle. Only two more months of formula. Thank goodness, it's expensive. I've been able to get free samples from neighbors and I've been able to get like 
clearance formula that like expires soon and so I've been able to get good deals on it but it's still an expense that I'm tired of having to pay and we only just started paying it like a month ago because I breastfed him up until then but now that we're on formula he just goes through it so fast and it's just so expensive so I'm very ready for him to be onto the whole milk with gray because that is like two dollars although I'll probably have to get like two gallons a week instead of just one because gray goes through about a gallon a week himself so yeah we're gonna need a lot of milk Unfortunately, Anthony only likes skim milk. So right now I'm having to get skim and whole milk. Um, Gray will eat any milk, but they say whole milk is best for kids. So I'm trying to keep him on whole milk as long as I can. I'm not a fan of milk. It's just not my favorite. I'll eat it with cereal um, and if it's an ingredient and stuff, but I just, I won't drink it by itself. So I, I'm not drinking the milk. It's just Anthony and Grayson. It's really Grayson. He just drinks it all. But I have a feeling once Porter starts drinking whole milk, I'm going to go through it like crazy. So we'll see. We've given Gray chocolate milk before and he has like that. Um, and we've tried juice apple juice, lemonade, like other things. And he is not a fan. Really, all he likes is milk and water. And really, it's just milk. Like milk is his favorite, which is funny because I just always hear about kids his age, like being so into juice and it being so bad for them. Like they say you should only do like a cup a day or something, like not a lot because juice is just not nutritious at all. But he could care less. Like we've done slushies before, he does not like them. Like any kind of like lemonade slushie does not like. So it's very interesting. He really just prefers his milk. And I'm okay with that. It's cheap and it's good for you. So I'm cool with the milk thing. Um, hopefully Porter is that way too, we'll see. Is the Jeep gonna go over the bridge? Is that Jeep go down the bridge? Going down the bridge? Anthony's pushing Porter. Hi, Mama. Hi, Jeep. Is it going down? Yeah, it's going down the bridge.